Namaste guys, Ashish here from Namaste Tech and in this video we are going to talk about how to lock applications in your Nokia 7.1 device. Now we know that Nokia devices come with pure Android. This means there is no native feature inbuilt into the phone that can actually do a app locking or unlocking thing using fingerprint sensor, not even with a pattern. So the only option that is left to us on the Nokia 7.1 is using a third party app called as App Lock. App Lock is APPLOCK, which is available in the Play Store, is a very popular app which comes with a lot of features that you can help to fine tune your unlocking applications through fingerprint sensor. Let's begin with it. Now the first thing that you need to do is add your fingerprint and a pattern or a pin, whatever you want on your phone. This will make sure that when you are about to enable the app locking feature of the fingerprint it's available right there done that open play store and search for the application app lock once you find it install it post installation you will have to go through some basic steps for example it will ask you to set up a pattern which can be different from your phone followed by your email id which is useful when you want to recover in case you have forgotten your pattern or pin you can use your email id to actually recover things. So yep, we have a backup solution. After the basic setup is done, launch the AppLock application and it will offer you list of application that is available on your phone that can be logged. Apart from that, you can also log down some of the core features of Android like Wi-Fi settings, even the phone complete settings section and other things through the app lock. Then that, select one of the application you want to lock down. The first time you select it, it will ask you to give permission so that it can use the locking feature. Give the permission and come back to the application. Now lock down some of the applications, exit the app lock and then try unlocking it using the usual pattern method. This is only to make sure that things are working for sure. Now come back to the app lock application again, you will have to draw the pattern again and here move to the protection section. The protection section has list of small, small options that you can use to fine tune your experience with app locking. The first thing is unlock settings. Here you can change from pattern to pin if you want to unlock applications. The second section is the security settings. Here you can choose a favorite question answer along with your email ID. The third option is what we were looking at, the fingerprint unlock, toggle this on, and now your fingerprint can be used to unlock the applications. Now, before you go ahead and try it out, there are a few more settings that you need to take a look at. Under general, you will have two options. The first is allow a brief exit. Now, it may so happen that you will have a couple of apps that is locked with your fingerprint. And if you switch between them, it will prompt you for unlocking again and again. This is annoying. So you can select brief exit to like 30 seconds or a minute so that it doesn't ask you for a password or a pattern or your fingerprint when you switch between them often. However, after the set time, it will ask you for unlocking it again. The second option is when you want to make sure that when you lock the phone, all the applications are locked automatically. Now this is important. Let's say if you give your phone to somebody else and your application timeout hasn't happened till now, he will be able to access your applications which are supposed to be locked. So make sure you turn that on as well. Now launch those applications which you have selected to lock down. When you select them, it will ask you for a pattern or a fingerprint. Now the app lock app notifies about the fingerprint thing on top left. It looks like a fingerprint icon. And when you touch the fingerprint sensor with the fingerprint you have configured on your phone, it will go green. In case you're using some other finger, it'll go red. So either you can use the fingerprint or if you are not using the fingerprint, you're not in a position to use your fingerprint, you can just draw the pattern or a pin and unlock it. So guys, that's how you lock and lock your applications, unlock your 7.1 using your fingerprint sensor. If you did like the video, do hit the like button, share it with your friends who have got a pure Android or Nokia device and they can lock down your applications. It works across Nokia devices. And yes, if you did like our channel, do hit the subscribe button or the bell icon so you get notification about such videos again. Thanks for watching.